Good afternoon. Twelve children were taken to the hospital this morning. Many more were shaken up after their school bus crashed in northern New Mexico. The bus was carrying kids from Santa Fe schools when it tipped over on Two Trails Road. News 13's Kim Baez is here with more. The bus driver tells investigators he saw a rabbit in the middle of the road, swerved to avoid it. That is when he lost control, hit a bush and a mailbox, and the bus tipped over on its side. The kids on board say it was scary. I just heard everybody screaming and screaming and screaming, and then I saw my friend Jerome. He um, was hanging onto the seat, and he... Um, he um, I just saw him fly and hit the window. Little Santi Watts was one of 26 kids on board. The Santa Fe County Fire Department says they transported 12 with injuries, ranging from cuts and bruises to a broken nose and dislocated collarbone. The students were from Santa Fe High School, Capshaw Middle School, and Adelia Elementary School. Well, the Santa Fe County Sheriff's Office says there are no signs that the bus driver was impaired. He was given a drug test. They say the driver, 49-year-old Leonard E. Serrano, has been issued two citations, one for careless driving, the other for not having a current medical card, which is required of bus drivers. Many of the parents whose kids were on that bus say they learned what happened when they got frantic cell phone calls from their kids. And he was very upset and he was crying and he was like, Mom, we got in a car accident, the bus flipped. And I told him, well, are you okay? Are you okay? And he was like, I'm okay. I'm okay. The ambulance is coming. The sheriff's department says the older kids on the bus really helped after the accident. They opened the emergency exit and helped get the younger kids out. Back to you. All right, thanks, Kim. The sheriff's office says most of the kids taken to the hospital have already 